What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to talk about Nintendo. And of course we're not talking about the Nintendo Switch because I'd actually be super excited. In this video I have to be a little sad. I'm saddened at the news that Nintendo <laughs> is ending development and manufacturing of <laughs> the Nintendo Wii U. I'm just kidding. It's good news. Anyway, Nintendo's Wii U is no longer being manufactured in Japan. Now, about two weeks ago, we heard rumblings of this in the mainstream media. IGN, GameSpot, Eurogamer, they all handed to this. And Nintendo came out and said, au contraire. We are continuing manufacturing our Wii U consoles, but it appears that all good things, bad things, horrible things must come to an end, and I'll drop a link in the description. Nintendo ending Japanese sales of Wii U, shifting to the Switch. Are you surprised? Nintendo Company is ending sales in Japan of its Wii U home console soon, although it's not saying exactly when, and similar announcements are expected in other regions, like the US. The Wii U, which went on sale from late 2012, is being replaced by the Switch, set to go on sale globally in March of 2017. Nintendo says it will show it to reporters in Japan on January 13th. The Japanese manufacturer behind the Super Mario and Pokemon franchises has already shipped Wii U machines for US sales through March. Company spokesman Kinichio Matsura said Friday. I'm sorry, that's just, that's how I speak Japanese. Cultial based Nintendo also scored success with the remake of its 1980s Famicom machine called the NES Classic Edition, which goes on sale Friday in the US for $59.99. Japanese have been snatching it up since it went on sale Thursday. Much smaller than the original machine, it comes packed with 30 popular software titles such as Donkey Kong, the Legend of Zelda and Super Mario Brothers. Another recent hit the company has scored is Pokemon Go, an augmented reality game that can be played on smartphones. Nintendo's earnings have suffered from lagging sales of the Wii U as well as its 3DS handheld. After years of scoffing at threats from smartphones, Nintendo did an about face last year and entered that sector. Pokemon Go is the first big success for Nintendo since that decision, underlining the company's potential. So, the Wii U is dead, the Switch is alive, and I'm excited. I'm actually aroused at the thought of that. I haven't played my Wii U in a while. Even though I love Smash Brothers Wii U, I do enjoy Bayonetta 2 on the Wii U, and that's about it. Now, I know that I do know that Mario Maker and Toad Treasure Tracker and the, the Mario Kart, all these games are great on the Wii U, but for me, those games might be fun, and I'm sure that they are. I just haven't had a chance to play them, and other consoles and exclusives have kind of drawn my attention away from the Wii U. And it's really an unfortunate thing because I think Nintendo really had some potential with the console. It just didn't get a lot of third party support, and the games that they made just really weren't enough for me to keep the Wii U alive. As you guys may know, the Wii U only sold 14 million consoles worldwide since 2012. I think PlayStation 4 did that in five minutes. So it's good to see Nintendo moving forward with the Nintendo Switch. I'm very optimistic as far as I think the sales are gonna go for the Switch. I think it's gonna probably do a few million the first year. I, I mean, I don't know if it's gonna sell as well as the PS4, but I think it's gonna do damn well, especially if it's reasonably and competitively priced. You guys let me know what you think in the comments below. Are you still playing your Wii U? Are you sad that it's going to go? Are you extremely happy that it's getting the hell out of here? Let me know what you think in the comments below. Be sure to give a thumbs up and show support for the channel. Join the Facebook group. Follow me on Twitter and show your support by going to BeastlyGamer.com. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time.